What? You didn't think we could do a nostalgic channel without doing this, did you? Yeah, I have some rareware on here for it to be truly nostalgic. How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave, and let's enjoy this beginning thing. Welcome to Let's Play Banjo Kazooie. I mean, you can't, you can't have. Come on, this, this is a freaking nostalgia train. You, you, you can't have nostalgia without one of the most. Uh, who am I kidding? In my personal opinion, one of the best N64 games in existence. And as much as it is an online part of the uh, N Nintendo online service, I actually am doing it on the N64. Cor special cords and all. <sighs> but that being said, let's let uh, these guys finish up their random shenanigans and get started. Yo. Uh -huh. Nineteen ninety-eight. It's been that long. <laughs> All right, let's get started. That's a lot of green fog. I've always wondered how to do these voices. I'm like, uh. <laughs> Dingpot, Dingpot, by the bench. Who is the nicest looking wench? Why, it's Grunty any day. She really takes my breath away. <laughs> yes, you're right. I'm rather proud. My looks stand me out from the crowd. Um, yes, but not in a good way, Grunty. Uh, but there's this girl. So we're basically pulling a Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs here. No, no, that cannot be. There's no one prettier than me. Why, it's Tootie, young and small. She's the prettiest girl of all. No, 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 you must be mad. Nicer beauty can't be had. Have you seen yourself? Fortunately, I think you'll find it's Tootie. She's cute and kind. Two things you aren't. Well, we'll see about that. This can't go well. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hi there, Tootie. What are you going to do today? When my big lazy brother wakes up, we're going on an adventure! Yeah. Banjo, it's not the winner. Get out of hibernation. Wake up, Banjo! I want to go on an adventure, too! Oh, don't worry, Kazooie. We'll be doing that. For about... Hmm. Seven, eight hours. Is that your brother? Where? Mr. Mole? I can't see him. Up there, in the sky. I don't think so. Come to me, my little pretty. You'll soon be ugly. What a pity. Let me go, you ugly old hag! <laughs> Don't scratch and bite, my little bear. You'll soon need bigger underwear. Oh no! She's got her! Somebody! Help! Uh, Banjo! Wake up! <sighs> what do you want, Kazooie? 
Let's get outside. There's trouble. Well, time for one of the most charming games that I've ever played. Hello. On the N64 again. Hi! Listen up, I'm Bottles, the short-sighted mole. I'm Banjo. This here's my buddy Kazooie. Sure is a strange looking buddy, Banjo. Can it talk? Better than you can, Google boy. Goggle, whatever. What was all the noise about? Where's my sister, Tootie? Ugly witch Gruntilda swooped down out of the sky and grabbed her. Calm down, Kiki. We'll get her back. Where'd she go? She flew up to her mountain lair. It's really dangerous, so you'll probably need some training before you go up there. Nah! <laughs> Press A if you want me to teach you. Nah! No thanks. You bet you. But we're already good enough. Mm, very well. I'll give you some basic your basic moves. You meet me at the top of the spiral mountain. I'll I'll I'll, I'll do that in a sec. I don't know why I just did that. <laughs> Now let's swim around this. We're gonna swim around Spiral Mountain. The mountain is so small. Like, how is this spiral? How is this a mountain? So I will point out because it's so easy to do, we are definitely 100%ing this game. For future levels, you guys will be seeing speed ups. Yeah, you're a honeycomb. I know. I didn't read that for a good reason. I already. Anybody who's played this already knows what this is. <laughs> I mean, that's two of six. I can number. My, my brain was so close to saying five. That was so hard to get. You know, I don't know how I did that. I, 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 I question every detail on how that just happened. I mean, I sat here for a while and was like, hmm, I wonder. I don't know how I'm gonna get that. How do you- Whoa, I got it! <laughs> hey, buddy. Die, buddy. You are not my friend. I am not very nice to these things, I know. This tree... Feels like an obscure place to put it, but it works. Hey, buddy. I was about to say fear the fruit. My backpack is a blueberry. I shoved a bird's body inside of a blueberry and said, let's carry this around. <laughs> uh -huh. Those one-ups, what I find funny about those one-ups is that you can have nine of them, which is the visual limit, but you can keep grinding and it actually keeps a counter in the background. So far back in the day, that was like. I'm used to doing something that I don't have yet. I feel like I'm missing one, aren't I? No, I'm not. Alright, let's get going. Up the spiral mountain we go. Hey, Kazooie! Yeah, Banjo! You st are you doing well, the blueberry over there? <laughs> Banjo, are you okay? Don't ask me. So you're ready to tackle the witch now? You sure are. Show us the way, Bottle Boy. Cross the bridge to enter Gruntilda's lair. Look out for me inside. Good luck. Nah. I'm not even gonna bother. Dim, dim, dim. Dim, 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 dim. Oh, jeez. Okay, hi. Hey, 
This fine contraption, this fine contraption, I'm told, will make young and tootie old. Let me go, you fat hag! My brother will come and kick your butt! Skew, he will not dare! There's many dangers in my lair! Hurry, Klungo, push that switch! I'm tired of being an ugly fat witch! Um, you're gonna have to wait till I collected 900 notes and 100 jiggies, I think. Oh, I should, I didn't read that. Hey, it's me, Mr. Jiggy. Now go and find a picture with the piece missing. Oh. <laughs> I love that fanfare. All right, so we're in here now, and... Boggles get... Shut up, Boggles, I know how to... I know. To enter the world, do this and that, and put... Fill in the blanks! It's simple enough, come on, shut up. Right, to fill in the missing places. Because you've got a very old version of this game, press A. Like that? <laughs> That's it! The picture's complete! And the door to Mumbo's Mountain is open! That was such an easy fit! The others may just test your wit- Ah, try me! Bet. We'll beat this area in this episode. Well, we will, actually. So each episode... I don't know if I'm gonna make it 20 minutes or 40 minutes. Maybe 20. Maybe 40. Jinjo! Yippee! You saved me! Runty has imprisoned five of us Jinjos on each world. Free all of us to get a Jiggy! I mean, simple enough. Notes, 100 each. Alright. I missed a note. I now suck. <laughs> I love how slow. I feel like. I don't know if it's just me, so I've played the Xbox uh, version of this game as well. Um, I don't know if it's just me, but I'm pretty sure this version is a lot more lenient on you. Like, it's easier or something. Hi. Shut up. How dare you tell me to go away? Beware the blueberry on my back! I mean, buddy, come on. Dude! Hey! Don't touch Gunga's blocks! Find Gunga's gold! Steal Gunga's gold! <laughs> you must search for ten of us in each world. We'll help you progress through the witch's lair. That was horrible. That was horrible voice acting. Uh huh. When you're ready to leave this world, return to this start area and stand on the exit pad. Hey, that conga sword. Put it back. Nah. I want me feed monkey. Bear feed monkey. Monkey's eyed blueberry, so bear got orange. <laughs> Chimpy, like. Okay, chi okay. Bye, Chimpy. Yeah. Uh -huh. I'll be back for what I need to take care of up there in a little bit. But first, catch me if you can, Conga. Fail. I'm gonna go up on this side. Aw, oh, man. Things a bit slippy. Huh? Find me and I'll teach you how to get up steep slopes. Um, alright. Well, I see you, but give me a sec.
I mean, it doesn't take a blueberry to find something that's in plain sight. I think. Eat Mambo Token. Eat his tribe Mambo Magic. Well, hello there. The Tyrant Trot will let Kazuri tackle steep slopes with ease. That sounds useful. How does she do it? I know how. Shut up. Like that. <laughs> uh, this is where camera kind of becomes a bit weird. You don't see me, I'm not here. You don't see me, I'm not here. I'm so small that you can't see me. Or I, you know, I blend in with the environment. Something of those sorts. I'm an idiot. I just needed the Mumbo token. Munbo? Someone explain to me what a Munbo token is? I don't know. Alright, let's go up here and... Hi. I call this beat. I call this the beat buster. Basically, it's the ground pound of this game. I don't like the sound of that banjo. Get used to it, nurse girl. You'll be using it a lot. <laughs> wow. You guys just love hating on each other, don't you? Hold up. Pause for a moment. I'm getting the call. That was a fun call. Um, that was actually Pink Fox. She was out. I got a quick call from her. Wasn't going to ignore it, that's for sure. One thing I find funny is that you get no time removal from that at all. Boom. When it's on pause. A lot of games, even back then, it still counted as gameplay even if you were pausing the game. Or at least from the SNES era. I guess that was fixed on the N64 and I never noticed it. Yeah, these are eggs. Apparently they're coming out of Kazooie without me knowing. Kazooie, how many babies do you got? You're in a blueberry. How are you producing babies in there and then expanding them out into this world? One more. Yippee! You've collected enough notes to break the first note door. Whoa! <laughs> Die. Do not laugh at my blueberry back. <laughs> I can only imagine Banjo like going in like that. Just like mad or something. Everybody looks at Banjo going, Are you okay? This is a... F that... Why did I do that? This is what I meant to do. 57 note count. 60. Uh, 3. Six, sixty-nine, and let's go back up here really quick. Actually, there's another way to get. So there is another way to get what I'm about to get. This is not the dev intended way. I know that for a fact. But <laughs> there you go. I still have to get the second one, which is inaccessible to me. I just realized this. All right, so crossing the bridge. I missed the health. I missed the health. You can keep throwing that oranges at me if you want. Woohoo! 
Time for the poster to learn the ancient ways of the eggs. I'm listening, Beetle Breath. Hold Z, then press the tops. Yeah, I know. Basically, to spit it out. Z, C, up. To shit it out. Z, C, down. Her brain can carry eggs in her back. That's not a backpack. Wow, is that camouflaged? I'm impressed with myself. Now that you've learned to use the eggs, here's 50 to practice with. Okay, I can make it official though. Each of these is going to be a 40 minute episode. Well, hey! Nothing more I can teach you in this world. Zoe's just like, hey, we got rid of that mother humper. Be gentle with me, Banjo. I'm a fragile thing. Nah. I think my fastest time in this area, or at least in past for in past playthroughs, um, whether this version or not, I can't remember. Come at me, bro! That's two. Ah, no, you don't. Ah, no, you don't. There we go. Be conga. Be compressed to bear. Well, Donga serves you right. I'm taking that now. Whoa. Yeah. Whoa, hey. I already got your gold. I'm gonna leave you alone now. Jeez. Before we progress, though. Notes! I'll get the Jinjo in a sec. This is one of those games I personally would never want to rush. People sped run it, but I'm like, no. My brain goes, uh-uh. This game is way too good. Take this game in like a nice hot cup of hot cocoa uh, during the winter. Jinjo! Uh -huh. I'm gonna do that every time he gets a jiggy. Get ready for that montage. <laughs> hey, buddy. Oh, wait, I'm not your buddy. Screw you. Actually, they're not really attacking me. Okay, never mind. How did I miss that? I buffed that! Um... Um... I did a bad... Uh -huh. I know you can get on there. I want, I want on top. How many Mumbo tokens do I got? Five. I have enough. Hey Mumbo. Hi. Best shaman in all game. Can help Banjo if they'll think that they're one. Watch it, hot boy. Mumbo's magic tokens. Made by which my tokens and mumbo help you. Ah, Banjo had to take tokens. Stand up, skull, and press. Okay. I'm not going to get every token in the game, but I'll try to get as many as I can. You know, why the heck not? Let's just, let's just collect as many eggs as possible. Hope you don't mind, Kazooie. That ground pound, if you mix it with the flight thing, the drift, is well enough. It can actually save your life. Mumbo's magic free to change back. 
you'll come when ready. Okay, bye bye. What? Turbine gets small, but not bad for first spell. Mumbo practice needs it. Alright, well, have fun with that practice session, Mumbo. I'm a. I'm going to admit defeat because that last totem thing, I. My brain is going, don't shoot it down, don't shoot it down, don't shoot it down. What do I do? I shoot it. I. Get me that cool backpack or else. What you gonna do? It ain't a backpack, it's a blueberry. There's your proof right there. It's definitely a blueberry, otherwise, it would not fit an owl. That was so stupid. <laughs> There's your proof this is a blueberry, not a backpack. It would not fit on my character's back right now if it wasn't. Hi! Ring around the termites. They try to attack me out of spite. You found all the notes in this world! Hey! I mean, finding all the notes in this game is not that hard. Na 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 neener. You want my blueberry? Come and get it. Oh, wait, you can't reach me. <laughs> I want that one up. Uh -huh. And. Oh man, I wasn't able to get the animation. Because I'm a freaking termite. Wee! Uh oh. That did no damage to my character. How? So level one is almost complete. I messed up on one thing. However, we have to go back as a termite, anyways. A anyway. Lucky me! Rupti's magic stops you. Taking the notes off the world. Yeah, I know. Yeah, the hundred you just collected. Best score. Try to get a hundred in each world as they are needed to open the net. They're needed in this playthrough anyway, dude. We're hundred percent in this game, dang it. Including... Which I think this is going to be stupid, but including the stop and swap stuff at the very, very end of the game. But that'll be post-game, so we don't have to worry about that yet. I'm an idiot. Dang it! We're gonna ignore the fact that I made that sound. Mumbo magic get weak. And we'll turn back or magic go. Okay. Magic go gone. Let's go back to bear and burn. No. I might as well trigger him saying that because I knew it was going to happen in the distant future anyway. Distant future meaning some episode at some point. <laughs> all right. Now, since we got all the notes already, um, what I'm going to focus on here is killing this butthole and going and doing the totem thing. Don't shoot all of them down, Dave. <laughs> this guy. Hello. I've done that mistake so many times like an idiot that I don't even know what to say. Hit one, two, three, not that one. There we go. All right, now we're done. We are done with this world. I hope. If I missed anything here, that, that would have just been sad. But I'm pretty sure I got all of it. That being said, we also got the one that this world provided for Grunty's Lair. So next up, we are going to head over, wait, what? I'm sorry, Grunty, I, I was trying to explain things. I was focused on the fact that I'm so pleased by myself hiding my bird in my blueberry. The bird in the blueberry is just a good idea all in all, I swear it. This is an oak door. Yeah, I know. Basically, 50 notes on this door, and I'll be able to knock. I'll be able to progress. I wonder if there's a way to glitch through these doors where you can, like, get no notes and beat the game. Kind of like in Mario 64, where in the Japanese version, where you can glitch your way through 
each and beat the game with zero stars. I don't find the point in it, but... Yuh-huh! Yeah. Yeah. Moving on. But it is what it is. That door was easy you got past. Unfortunately, your first and your last. <laughs> that's pretty, actually. That's pretty close. Don't judge me, okay? I voice act every day. Almost every day. Hi. You've activated a magic cauldron. Find two. Yeah, I know. Find two to create a shortcut. These shortcuts are near pointless. Hey! The bird is sticking its feet and its head and its body and its wings outside of my blueberry. I'm surprised said blueberry isn't crushed. Remove pieces, press B. Next thing I do this in, he'll say to insert them all, press C. I know. Shut up. Welcome back to the days of the N64. I have no save states. That's why the 40 minute episodes. Otherwise, I probably would have made these ones 20 minutes, to be honest. Actually, no. I attempted to play through this once on my channel. I don't remember why I stopped, but. Hello? You know what? While we're over here. Down here. While we're over here, we might as well trigger this. First of all. Mumbo token, and I am walking drunk, basically. You activated a magic culture. Find two the same color to create a shortcut. Alright. I don't want to see you alive. You're not allowed. Oh, right. You figure that would hurt Kazooie at this point. Golden feather that I don't need yet, but you know what? Why the hell not? Hello, invulnerability feather. I'm just going to call you a gold feather. It's much easier on my part. Hi. What am I doing? Monsters chase you, they're a hounding. Then you'll get a grunty pounding. That's assuming I make it up to you on your end. So on my f on the sideline, I'm going to leave notes. There is a reason for this. This is one of the last things we're going to do in this episode, first of all. Hi. You're for... That is so blurred, but that says click clock wood. I'm like, why is it so blurred? Wait. How I never knew about that, I don't know. Hello there, young ones. I'm Bruntilda. Bruntilda's nicer sister. I've crept down here to help you defeat the old hag. It's about time she was taught a lesson. I know all of Grunty's disgusting secrets, and I'll tell you three of them. Remember them well. Yeah, there are 30, I think. I might miss some of them if I do. Oops. Now, we're not going to do these until the very end, possibly. You know what? Nah. What do you have to tell me? Grunty's nickname was Hog Breath at Witch School. The last time I did that, it was Hattie Fatty. So, that's new. Normally, that's what I get. So, alright. Grunty. Facts. Notes. I'm putting on the note, notes section for my phone. Ah, there we go. That's what I want. It always automatically does something. So, one. Nick. Name in school was something that I forgot. What's the next one? I also note that freshly burst boils is her favorite smell. Freshly 
first. Boils? That's weird. Favorite. Smell. And. Favorite color is gruesome green. I got that same answer last time. Favorite color gruesome green. Now, what was the first one again? What was her nickname in school? Hogbra. Okay. All right, so that's the first three of apparently 30 questions, if I remember correctly, that are kind of important for right before the final boss, who I still have to figure out one of the phases. For the most part, I've got the final boss figured out. If you've played Spyro 2, you know how to do the final part of it, but we'll get to that when we get there. Right now, we are surprisingly out of time. So, one thing I don't like about this game that you'll probably catch me starting off a lot is you'll start me at the beginning of... I'll usually start at the beginning of the layer, personally, so... Timestamp is not gonna match in, like, in-game at all. However, this is where we'll start next episode. In this area. Wherever it might be. It'll probably be just, like, right here where he first enters. I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna leave this video here. So, the blueberry on my back which Kazooie is cr still crammed inside, which I still question. Long of tooth and strong of arm, Grunty's got the lasting charm. Bull crap, Grunty. I'm going to leave this video here. So thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Banjo-Kazooie. Definitely looking forward to this series, especially 100%ing it, including the stuff that will impact the next game. If you guys are looking forward to seeing more of this, Push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. And if you really like to consider subscribing to the channel. Being that this is the first rare rare game that we're be we're good rare rare game that we're doing on this channel. Um the link of the bottom right corner will be a random location that the train can take you to where you might enjoy it. Um if you're ready to see the rest of the stops on this right, if you watch this in the distant future, click the link across right here, and the train will take you to the new playlist for this series. In the meantime, though, this train's off to its next destination. Hope you guys are looking forward to this as much as I am. And we hope to catch all of you in another ride. Bye!